and I think we're live. I think we're live. Um, if things sound different, um, uh, I, I, I put my mic on the little stand thing it comes with. And, uh, it blocks most of my computer, but I can still see my monitor. Let me make sure chat is still on here. I don't know where the chat is. Oh, there it is. Okay. Chat is still on here. It's in the top right corner. If anyone types, it should pop up there. And I'm sorry if the mic is more sensitive. I took off the cover that is usually sitting on it, but we'll see. We'll see what it's like in post. <laughs> it's bad. Uh, it's still going in the YouTube channel, probably. I haven't played this song in- or this game. <laughs> Not this song. I haven't played this game in a long time, so I'm gonna refresh myself real quick. Uh, Y is attack. A is bash. Weapon ability is R. RL. Or RZ is what they- Okay. Struggle is X. Oh. And my finisher is the left trigger. I guess I'm going in. Also, um, I keep forgetting that headphones. Let me. I am gonna adjust the sound because I can't adjust sound. I can make it louder for you, right? Which is cool. But for me, my monitor doesn't have volume settings and it doesn't have a headphone jack. So it's just stressful that I can't use my headphones when I wish I could. I wonder, do I go into games too early? A lot of streamers, they, uh, they wait like 5-10 minutes to let people get into the stream, but I'm not a professional and uh, I have two subscribers, so and one uh, isn't in the same time zone, so he might not even be able to watch my stuff. Is this endless mode? Yes, I have unlocked the Briar Folk, which sucks, I hate the Briar Folk. Ugh. I love this game. I miss this game. Take aim and undercover. What lurks in Iron Peak? Reyna's remarkable fishing and unrest in Iron Peak. Would you like to enable apprentice mode? This will make combat easier by increasing your damage and automating reposts and finishers. I think I'm going to turn it on. <laughs> because uh, this game is really hard. And if you guys want to watch me play it on harder modes, um, there's endless mode. The first game was really good. Um, everyone says that this game is a lot better. I have played it. It's like three years old at this point. But I haven't played it since, so I'm excited to get back in. Yeah, I have gold in a lot of them. Because I worked hard. I worked hard. I hope this is gold and not bronze, because that would be a shame. I don't know if... So yeah, I've been doing campaigns. I have not- oh yeah, I didn't buy the um, DLC Endless Mode, I haven't tried. And Campfire is where you change your appearance of your character. But this game is like a deck building... I would say like D&D kind of game. And when you build your deck, it controls what events pop up and weapons and items. I think Lovers was the one that was really hard for me. But I think I'm gonna go in to Chariot. I've just been doing them in order, so. My companion. So I currently have the Wanderer as my companion. The Magician was cool. He gave me a shield, but I don't- I haven't played in a while, so. It play Chariot to unlock, so that's cool. I'm gonna unlock some more people later on. I probably will get the DLC, but 
Right now we have him. My encounters, I believe, like right now I'm full. My encounters are pieces that I don't have yet. Like this is new. Burning building is hard. The more I play, the more I'll know which ones I need because you get certain items. Yeah, so gain food, chance to get cards, spend gold, and there's a shop here. I, this is new, but I can get a token. Um, shards, which I don't have yet. Um, the equipment, precision, and I could lose maximum health in there. Right now, <laughs> All right, corrupted, but you get gold. This is one that I I've done before. I like it because you I and I'm broke most of the time. I play this game, so but yeah, I did just I did just get these two. Hmm. And I believe this one is specifically for my companion. Like, if I put this in, I think I can only do it if my companion is the guy that I chose. But yeah, I have a lot of new stuff. I- oh, I remember duels. <laughs> Beat the snot out of some people. For some reason, it looks like I don't have the shards for those, though. Like, you can see over here, there's no shards on these. I don't know. It's- been a while, which is why we're playing on the easier mode, because I don't know what I'm doing right now. But also, this is, I think, I think this is a new mission to me, so I don't necessarily know what I need yet. So this one, this weapon is good for thieves. This is a chance to stun and a stun blast. I don't starve, which is good, because I starve a lot. This one, I believe... It makes you eat more food. Inspect. There we go. Gain two food or one plus food in Endless after every encounter in which you receive a gain card. Reduce it so I'm slower. But we'll figure it out. I really do like this weapon, but it's hard to get it. I believe you need really high fame to equip that weapon. And supplies. I think you just start with these. I don't know why I like to start. I think it depended on the main enemy. So. Cannot repost. Um, it, it's good for armored. This one's good for armored people. I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Let's go in. I think those were thieves. Those were thieves, so... Um... That's not good for me. I picked the, um, the heavier weapon. The chariot is a symbol of control. Taking control of the horses of your emotions and binding them to the chariot of your will. If you can do that, Perhaps we can navigate these roads together. All right. Sir Malfoy looks down from the back of his steed at the soldiers lined rank and file before him. The city is lost to the plague, he says dryly. We will not waste another soldier on this place. He gives the final command. In the name of the emperor, prepare to withdraw. Lock the gatehouses. Let no one in. At sunrise, burn the city to the ground. Without hesitation, the soldiers march down the cobbled street towards the western gatehouse. A single soldier remains, a captain. She removes her helm to reveal a quiff of golden hair and an eye patch, concealing a wound from a battle long ago. She approaches you in a culpjorn. <laughs> Many innocent people will die. Come morning, if- oh, oh, I remember this now. Yes. <laughs> Many innocent people will die come morning if nothing is done to correct the injustice, she explains. I ask that you aid my men in their search for citizens. 
to escort out the old city. Hurry, nightfall, fast approaches. Find and rescue and es find citizens find and rescue citizens and escort them out of the city. I'm gonna ask some questions. Oh god. I am Captain Fior, she says with a bow. I've been commanding my regiment on the northern border. My troops and I were recalled to the old city and were ready to march back to the capital. However, it appears the Empire has neglected its people. In our absence, I cannot abandon those who we have sworn to protect. What's the plan? I anticipate Malfoy's intentions, and my scouts have made preparations. To the southwest is a gatehouse, abandoned when the infected broke through. If we can clear the corrupted from this district, we can escort any citizens through with minimal resistance. Can it be done? Fear not. There are soldiers that remember the virtue of the Empire, who remain loyal to her people. I have a number of scouts searching the streets for citizens as we speak. They will assist where they can. A terrible tragedy for sure, while the Empire's eye on the northern border, it has abandoned its people to an unnatural plague. Do not be fooled, this is no ordinary midlay. It, its affliction maddens and warps the minds of those it corrupts, turning friends, enemies, or lovers into mindless agents of hate and aggression. The Empire is right to fear its rapid spread and po potential reach. However, there are many who call this city home, who have not been damned, not yet. It seems these souls I intend to save this night. It is these souls I intend to save this night. The old city was once the hub of the world. Great artisans, traders, merchants, and merchants would travel from afar. <laughs> would travel from far and wide to sell their wares here. While it still houses many, it is a shadow of its former glory, a muddle of streets, and in the light of the plague, many roads have been blocked. Nightfall approaches, let's make it quick, okay. My coachman will follow and transport any citizens you might find along the way. If you are lucky, they may be of assistance in your travel. Search the streets and kill the infected. I will send you word when the way is cleared. Um, can I look? Okay, yeah. So both of them are city streets. Wow, this is a, um, the map is an, uh, the map, uh, the, this, uh, I guess you can call this a map. I guess things will show up as I select other things because, uh, you're a little bland right now. My character turned sideways, so I'm going to actually go here first. The pauper district has been hit by looters, leaving shops with broken windows and empty shelves. Grateful citizens. You happened upon a group of frightened peasants, desperately seeking safety. We hear the Empire has abandoned the city, they cry. Please save us. You explain Captain Fiora's plan and help them on to the wagons. You saved eight citizens already? Okay. There's twelve corrupted. Okay, okay. <laughs> We are grateful, a woman says as she steps into the carriage. I haven't much food, but should you need some, I would be willing to trade. More food options available at the campfire. From this street, you can see other paths. So now more paths pop up, which is good. We're going to look at the map. <laughs> Road to Goblin Town. That is an event. I don't think I've never, I don't think I've ever made it into the Goblin Town. So I should probably take it now yeah every step i eat of food so is your reward at least in potential they say the road to goblin down is paved with gold and dead mice horus son of the village idiot has lured you 
into this cave with a promise of hidden treasure. You regret everything. Just go there. He points into the dark cavern. I saw a goblin hurrying into that hole not a moment ago. Goblin Town is there. I'm sure of it. Bro. I'm about to get... Well, I, I don't even think I could beat the goblins with the weapon I picked, so I probably... This was probably a bad idea. But, you know, first run is gonna be bad. That's why we're on a easier mode. It might help me out. <laughs> Ooh, this game still lags just as much as it used to. I mean, that this is a loading screen, so... Oh, okay, so this is like a trap area. But this is the part of the game that I like the most is- Ooh, ooh. You walking by yourself, girl? I am playing on a controller that should not have drift. Can I swing? Okay, I can. What am I sprint? She's moving by herself. That's that. Can I sprint? I think that was my sprint. Oh, Jesus, girl. Is there- Oh, okay, so maybe I have been here before. I mean the- Okay, I haven't been here before. Did that heal me just now? What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> I think I did it. I were in Goblin Town. So I think this will give me the token and I will unlock a card for Goblin Town. Horus is crestfallen when you tell him that Goblin Town wasn't down there. You didn't find the goblin either? Probably used their willy magic. I tell you what, if you manage to get your hands on a goblin, they might lead you there. So five gold, two fame. I don't think I won the token. I think I actually had to find the- oh! I did get the token. Okay, that's good. So no matter what, that means we made progress this run. I believe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we get to keep all tokens. <sighs> I'm not gonna go to camp. It's asking me if I wanna go to camp. I don't need food right now. The Popper District has been hit by looters, leaving shops with broken windows and empty shelves. Ooh, Drudge of Corruption. So we. <laughs> what is that? That's 11. 11 corrupted. You find yourself surrounded by the corrupted horde that broke through the gatehouse and wandered into the district. They shuffle mindlessly back and forth on the spot, limbs twitching, seemingly unaware of your presence. Inventory. <laughs> I got an axe? I, oh, oh yeah, wait, I think corrupted are armored. The only issue I'm having right now is that I don't have a lot of armor. But I'm gonna go in anyway. This might be the run killer. <laughs> oh yeah, Hulb Dorn is with me. Oh. The pendulum is ever changing, and the challenges it okay. presents change. We just went for silver. I don't think I can do gold. It's gonna knock out. Yeah, so he's gonna remove one of the monster cards. I think that if I had better luck, or if I had attempted to hit the gold, um then it would have taken away two. I think if you miss, it might like miss everything and add some. And if you hit the red, I think it, nothing changes. So loving, I love this game. <laughs> the remaining infected. So we took away five, I believe. No, not five. I can't, I'm not doing math. <laughs> I didn't pay attention to which card he took away, but we had 11. And now we are fighting nine. So I guess three, what? wait, wait, 11 down to nine, 10, nine, so two, was it two? I think it was two, that kind of sucks, but we're gonna go for it. I'm so nervous. Oh, oh, oh crap. I don't have to fight them for real. I'm not gonna do it. You can you tell that I'm thinking about going for the gold? I'm not gonna do it. Nicely timed. One more monster card. 
oh yeah because we snuck up on them so this is like this is like your role to see if you're successful when sneaking so we were successful so i think we have to fight yeah despite your best efforts the remaining infected closure we have to fight these last six wish me luck i already forgot how to fight i think why why button is one of the buttons Where's my weapon? I, I know I have it equipped it. Because if I don't... Oh, there it is. <laughs> but as you can see, there's a token on that weapon that I don't think I have yet, so... Mm. Barely more than a wood chopper's tool. Oh, God. Okay, I used my special. Move, girl, move. Okay, B. B is my dodge. Okay. Oh, she. I keep, I keep not pressing B. It would benefit me to actually press B. Oh, <laughs> he did his charge, but I. I got it, love. I got it. I kind of sucked. Um, she didn't auto use her um, specials, which is strange to me. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention, so um, the other guy might have been auto using his, but I'm not sure. That appears to be the last of them, Coldorn remarks. You continue your journey through the wine winding not winding through the winding streets you gain four fame fame is dangerous double-edged sword you can get you can use certain weapons when your fame goes up right some weapons like you need 30 fame and it's like the best weapon in the game and you know you want it you want to use it so you try to get 30 fame fame isn't always good if you're passing thieves on a trail and you have high fame they will recognize you and attack but if you have low fame, they're going to be like, I don't know who the fuck this is. And they're going to carry on with their day. So it pays to be unknown in some cases. But then again, your weapons will be weaker. I guess I'll take this fame though, <laughs> you know. Checking the map. Okay, Popper Plague is there. So I can, I think that's money. Get some money. And City Streets. Of course, we're trying to get to the gatehouse, but it pays to it pays to go on every card. I usually avoid going on every card near the end when I'm like dying. I have 81 health. I'm, I'm, I need food, but I think I'll be okay. The town crier announces the empire. What? <laughs> the town crier announces the empire seeks mercenaries to join the battle against corruption. You seek out the Wit Watchtower where recruitment is taking place. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. You arrive in time to hear Sir Malifol's plan to wipe out the Pauper District. Oh my god. The outbreak began there. We cannot risk sparing any of any of their lives. So he plans to kill all the poor people and the four of steel the two fours of steel those are knights so we have eight knights i think sir malfoil the green oh that's his title <laughs> sir malfoil the green leads the mercenaries to the pauper district where the poor and the sick have been walled off from the rest of the city over the wailing of corruption, Sir Malfoy gives his command to charge. I guess, I guess I see where he's coming from. But I have a feeling we're on the other side of that wall. <laughs> Ooh, oh, okay, okay. So, the Eight of Steel is on my side, I believe. And we have to fight a terror, a terror of light, which is a really super sick, like really bad. You don't want to fight, there's like a little boss. And then five of blight. Okay, we're just going in. Okay, <laughs> I thought 
I thought I was gonna get like a chance roll. No, we're just going straight in to fight the sick. Got my health, the boss. Uh, I believe those are the enemies, my weapon, and my armor. So, I like looking at the cards <laughs> as they fly in. Oof. Gotta be more aware of that B button now. Okay, she did just try to auto use her attack just now? Or was that just a finisher? Oh crap, I forgot there was a boss. Okay, okay. Okay, now I need to mash A to break his armor. Ooh, 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 I didn't press B fast enough. So he should be dead. Good job, good job. That was so stressful just now. I forget that this game, it, you need to be patient. Like, I, it pays off for me to be a little more patient than what I'm being right now. Zero corrupted remaining. <laughs> Sir Malfoil commends you for your bravery and offers you reward. You gain two fame. And 20 gold. See? 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 Look, 25. So we have a total of 60 gold. That's a lot to me right now since i haven't played in a long time i don't know how much a lot of gold is but to me that's a lot of gold right now we started with 10 and now we're here we bring word from captain fior i think that's how i said their name the soldier explains with a salute the infected horde at the next gate house has subsided the dealer removes corruption counter from the map okay but there's a problem. Corruption grows from the ground itself, blocking all passage for the wagons. It must be destroyed. She asked that we join you in your efforts. The soldier continues. Should you require our assistance, you only need ask. Okay. Estrella's allegiance. So reinforcements charges five out of five. So I think I can use it five out of five turn times. That means right before I go in the battle, I should activate the card and they'll come in with me. Prior to combat, yeah, optionally draw an Empire Ally card. This can be used before five combats or seven if Estrella is your companion. Then discard this card. Estrella is not my companion. Transient Blessing. Any number of blessings can be equipped at one time. That's fantastic. Transient Blessings are discarded when certain conditions are met. Yeah. I'm not going to camp yet. Okay, that might be a bad idea. For some reason... I guess because I'm using the axe, I cannot wield my shield. And I haven't acquired any new weapons yet. I should probably actually go to camp. But, um, I won't. Because <laughs> we're gonna continue on. Why would you move? Why can't I move? Do I have to go to camp? Can I move? <laughs> do I do I actually have to go to camp? You approach a horse drawn you approach You approach the horse drawn wagons. Captain Fear's soldiers stand to attention, and the head coachman tips the brim of his hood. We'll transport any people you find in these warrens, he explains. Just keep the wagon out of trouble. I can't buy equipment. I think that's what it meant when I, like, I get more citizens, then I can, um... Okay, so the food's actually cheap. But I'm not going to buy any because I can do that at any time. Okay. What does it mean to cook food? Oh, that just, I heal myself. Let's heal. There, so I healed myself for five. Okay, great camp. Oh, so I actually have to press the button. 
that's how I move. I can't like just move with the directional. I have to press A every time. Okay, you dash through the labyrinth of slum streets in the city center. You pass through without incident. Yeah, I think there's no more um zombies, so Ooh. 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 Burning building. I never I never get burning building right. So I I'm going to go in. You hear shouting up ahead as you make your way down the cobbled street. You see lights flickering on the road in front of you. As you approach, you see a building, flames and smoke billowing out of its upper room windows. A crowd has formed outside, passing buckets of water between one another to temper the blaze. As you push your way through the crowd, you see a woman frantically pleading to the villagers, Please help. My family is in there. Anyone? Please help. Ooh. <laughs> I could you lose my companion. Or hurt myself. I'm going to be mean and throw Kolb Jorn into the fire. Without a word, Kolb Jorn draws one of his mighty swords and enters the blazing building. Here we see yet another wheel. You see how there's only one success? Their own similarities. Fuck. <gasps> He's dead. <laughs> He's dead. You might want to work on this. Clearly you lack what it takes. Leave me alone, dealer. Suddenly when all feels seems lost, the silhouette of Kolb Jorn appears at the front door and collapses. You lose him for five turns. My odds probably would have been better if it was me. There are also things in this game that make your odds for events like this better. But I decided to risk him and I thought he was going to be gone permanently five turns at the beginning of the game. is not as bad as five turns at the end of the game, I'll say that much. No, Kolb Jorn. Oh crap! We're rolling to see if he saved them? Fuck. Here. Toll one. So he saved one of them? Toil? Let's see what you do with that, given your position. That's probably bad. I got six fame though. The villagers are grateful, but you see how the token went back on that card yeah i hate it when that happens we're gonna get this loan card down here can you reach the end of this challenge before you starve to death i didn't Time ask i didn't ask i have 60 gold sir you dash through the labyrinth of slum streets in the city center oh i killed them all you said we're gonna kill him. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Too early. Even when things appear impossible, they can be mastered. I know, I just haven't played in a long time. Yeah, I have to fight. Oh, oh, okay. Is it- be I'm, I'm looking at my monitor. Maybe I should be looking at- Oh, the stray- Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna use you. <laughs> Isn't that great that I ironically got that companion card and lost my companion? Isn't that cool? I think it's cool. When I set myself up for failure, the game set me up for victory. I just have to remember to straddle the B button. B button is important. When I see green, I need to press the blue button. Ooh, okay. Which button is my special? That's not it. <laughs> is it this button? Oh. <laughs> is it this button? Is it- is it this button? 
it's that button. I think my friends are dead. <laughs> but on the plus side, these guys should be easier to fight if I at least pretend to know what I'm doing. Okay, that's an execution. Move! <laughs> Okay, getting better, getting better. Getting better, getting better! Okay, so... <laughs> we're doing one run today, probably. We're already, like, at the 35 minute mark. But, but, um... I think we're gonna do a bit better if I keep playing. I gain for fame. That's a lot more, um, spaces than I thought I was gonna unlock, because... No mission exchange. I don't know if I want to um talk to the gnomes right now. I'm a little worse for wear. We're gonna go to camp. I was hoping that um we would get better food deals, but I don't think I'm gonna get any better food deals. So yeah. I thought I would need less food to finish the board, so. Empty, no new paths. Let's see what you guys want. Deal with them if you will. I would rather leave them be. You trespass on, you trespass, why would I? <laughs> you trespass on gnomish ground, human. A voice calls out as a dozen small creatures leap from the trees around you. The penalty of this transgression is death. Make peace with your gods. And I'm about to get folded. Okay. <laughs> Ugh, getting folded wouldn't be too bad. This wasn't a great run, I don't think. You guys look kind of scary. Fiercely territorial. Trespass in gnomish lands and face consequences. Pesky, persistent, and impossible to hit. Fuck. Gnomes cause a snare. Evade to oh, struggle to break free. Can only be deterred with a finisher. Okay. So we're going to have to finisher these little guys. What the fuck? Oh, they got me. They got me. I'm just pressing this trigger button right now. Okay, um... Easier than I thought? I thought I was dead, dead, because I got the wrong weapon for this. I got armor breaking weapon when I need a speed weapon, so... The battered gnomes pick themselves up from the battlefield and approach you cautiously. All right, the penalty for this transgression is no longer death. We'd like a parlay. With seek, we seek arms to defend ourselves, the gnome declares. Hand over some of your equipment and we'll release you. We can even pay you something. I don't have, I don't have, um. Give me a weapon I can wield and one of my brothers, and one for my brother, we've got gold. Yeah. I can't afford to give you my only weapon. Let me check. Is that my only weapon? Yeah. The warrior's axe. It's my only weapon. The gnomes quickly retreat into the trees, peering at you from the shallow from the shadows as you leave. I'm sorry. I can't afford that right now. Grateful hero. I'm not going to use Estrella's assistance this time because we have five people to help, so we're just going to go on without it. Oh, 
Hopefully I get better at fighting. B is evasion. B is evasion. B is evasion. I think I'm trying to figure out how to parry, but I don't have a um, shield, so I can't parry. So that's why I keep messing up. Because green means that you can parry it, I believe, but red means it is unavoidable and you have to dodge. Why did you turn? Okay. I would like you to turn the way I want you to turn. Ooh. I rolled into it. It's fine. Oh, my poor villager friends are down. Okay, that's what that... I'm trying to figure out why I couldn't hit him. <laughs> because he's my friend. I'm not supposed to hit him. And I have 46 health. <sighs> That's not good. I didn't press that button. She did that by herself. <laughs> you arrived just in time, the warrior explains. I don't think I could have held them off for much longer. I could part with some of my- Oh, yes! Give me your equipment, he continues. This is why I went through all of the trouble instead of going straight to the exit and to the next floor. I want to see if I can get items, you know. Trigger these cards. The more cards you land on, the more you trigger. The more food you eat, the more you have a chance of getting hurt, but you have a chance of getting good items. And a good item is what I want right now. I can part with some equipment, he continues. I don't think it will do me much good now. See me if you're interested for a trade. So I got five more citizens. Which I believe is for the ending. I think to get like a good ending, a really good ending, you would have to save all 60 citizens. I could not be more pleased to train you. Thanks, Dad. You have every skill Callus lacked. Patience, delicacy. Skill. Thanks. Sometimes he rags on you for taking too long. I'm sorry. Okay. So. I should probably go to camp. I should probably go to camp. Yeah. I should be able to get... Yes. There's one... Is this better than what I have? I have over seven fame. Corrupted inflict 25% less damage. So I think that's what's good. Um, ooh, but it also has don't starve, lose one max life instead of taking starvation damage, which means I can't starve. Which is also really good. So I think I am going to buy this. Yeah, and they're comparing it to what I'm currently wearing. Which is the Adventures Garb. Which, as you can see, has no defense on it. You see that? You see that? <laughs> they was busting my behind. Because I didn't have no defense. So yeah, of course. Um, I bought it, I think. I don't know if I actually... I guess I did pay for it. I just didn't pay attention to... Um, the money you see how the supplies hasn't um gone back up it's another reason i uh stall buying things because as you can see it's not going up i think i am just gonna go to the next floor for now the smell of rotting flesh lingers in the air Wait a minute. Is there another floor? If I read this? I'm not sure if this is like a one floor map or a two floor map. Uh, Whatever. The smell of rotting flesh lingers in the air. The gatehouse tower looms over you. Its sides encrusted with the taint of corruption. 
The captain greets you as you approach. Turn back inside. Okay, okay, I see, I see. So, I will continue to look for more villagers. That's what, okay, okay, I think I do got a little drift going on right now. The Popper District has been hit by looters. Okay, this is just a generic. Grateful citizens, okay. Eight more citizens. More food is available at the camp. No more new paths. I think I should go to the camp. <laughs> <We're>, <laughs> we cooked some food when I meant to buy some food. But that's important to me. And I don't think I'm going to actually get a chance to spend my gold. So we're going to do this. That's more than enough. Okay. Uh, we're going to cook. Feel safer with 70. We still have five um, food to travel. You dash through the labyrinth of slum streets slum. <laughs> in the city center. You navigate the maze of streets without incident. Okay. No incident. Okay, so that's all. We got. So I think she'll be like, okay, you got them all. Attack the inf infected because there's nobody else on this floor. I'm assuming there's another floor now. So now I can check out my inventory. We got the pie disrobes on. You can't come with me? You can't come with me? <laughs> you can't come with me? Oh, yes, she can. I was nervous just now. Corruption. The land itself becomes shattered, shambling, and broken. Attacks with bursts of corruption that snare and damage their targets. Use evade, which is the B button. <laughs> kind of remind myself. The B button. <laughs> to avoid their attacks or change direction rapidly to break free. Okay. Ooh, kicking my butt. I keep forgetting that, ooh, ooh, I also walk slower. Also, um, I can't control who I lock onto. I will go out there and say that because I would, I would like to be able to do that, but I can't. She locks onto whoever she feels like locking onto. Ooh, he needs to be revived. I'm happy I saw that because... Okay, that thing's attacking. And it got me. Get out of there. Get out of there. I killed it. 
<laughs> it almost got me just then. Almost got me. So we defeated the corruption at the gate tower. I think that's what it is. Gatehouse. Captain Fior addresses you. We have a steady string swing. I've never heard of that kind of term in my life, but okay. Oh, you. <laughs> wow. You have a steady swing. Yes, I do. Excellent, soldier. It will only be more difficult from here on. I bear no ill will towards you if you choose to leave now. Continue to the next district. As Captain Scout leads the wagons through the next through to the next district and seal the gates, you ascend the gate tower. The gatehouse tower. There we go. Skipping words. My allergies are really bad, so I'm blinking hard. The towers will watch over a stream of death and despair. Yeah, probably. <laughs> The tower provides a commanding view over the once impressive city. As you pause to catch your breath, you watch the last of the sun's rays disappear over the horizon. Kolbdorn shakes your shoulder and points over the battlements to the south. Ooh, the final refuge. As you can see, there is a lot of citizens to be saved. So it looks like we're gonna, there's like nine minutes left in the stream, but I think we're gonna just extend the stream. I'm gonna just go until I die, I think. The dealer adds corruption counter to the map. Uh, look at them. <laughs> 40. 40. Have you ever seen so many cold drone remarks as you watch the infected swarm the city wall? How can the empire let it let its people suffer so? Suffer so? Well, Kolbjorn mutters under his breath and then abandon. Oh, and then abandon those in need. Ugh. As you continue to look, a small glow appears on the horizon beyond the city perimeter. First one, then another, and another. The empire, Kolbjorn cries. They are preparing to burn the city. We must get the people to safety let us hope we are not too late i think we're too late homie like if they've already got the smoke thingies out there and we're screwed so we got more city streets we're gonna try to get to the um, final refuge 50 health good luck i'm trying to see what else i can actually see we've won one token so it even if we die now it's not entirely hopeless we need to buy food soon, though. The spread of plague has rendered the district a blackened maze. The crust of contagion warps cobblestones and weakens foundations, making progress perilous. M maybe you should look to regain our strength at the wagon. Yeah, I was thinking that, too. As you make your way through the winding road, the peasants may have food to trade. You right. So, nothing happened, but I'm going to camp. What do you have? Ugh. We're gonna buy it. I wasn't expecting, um, starvation to hit so quickly. Smoke fills the street and stings your eyes. The Empire intends to staunch the infection with fire. You pick up the pace. They believe fire purge this sickness but the sickness is not in the city oh, shit. it is in the land itself it will be purged but not like this with a terrible crash the building beside you is struck by a flaming catapult shot the building heaves and twists from the impact and crumbles across the street in front of you Kolbjorn shields their eyes from the blaze Quickly, we must find another way. You turn the wagon around and search for another road through the district. Ooh. That's painful. 
I can't go that way. Smoke fills the city and stings your eyes. The Empire intends to staunch the infection with fire. You pick up the pace. If there is a finer mind than my own, I've yet to meet it. Yet, I've brought a scourge of mindlessness into this world and must suffer the results. The wounded peasant runs, stumbling down the street, chased by a horde of corrupted. A horde. Ooh. See, we can fight the corrupted. Or, we can attempt to escape. I'm assuming if we do the attempt to escape, we'll be rolling dice for that one. And I don't think I can take a fight because I don't know if I can heal. So we will attempt. Yeah. Yeah. So the dude that was running from them, I don't know if I read it. It says he falls to, at your feet and begins to twitch. The blood from his wound boils and blackens. He's infected. We can't help him. I don't think there's a point in fighting these guys. You run for your life through unfamiliar streets, pursued relentlessly by the corrupted. Fuck. I hate the card wheel. I would rather roll. And it's hard to tell which ones are successes and which ones are fails. Skulls are bad. The hearts with the brambles on them, those, I think that's like pain. You get damaged and the swords are victory. Yes! <laughs> I'm so happy right now. I almost screamed. I almost screamed. Didn't scream. Ducking through the alleyways, you manage to lose some of your pursuers. So I think it's going to remove a card. Yes! Okay, so um, I think all bosses come with their own little minions, so no matter what, there will always be more enemies than stated. We do not need your assistance, Estrella. We're just going to mess them up on our own feel way better about that than uh just going in and fighting them i'm happy i didn't take pain though because i would have had to fight them and have already taken damage and that's just not fair and if you guys have been wondering where i've been and why i haven't been streaming my desk chair isn't in and i'm sitting in a lawn chair right now and it freaking sucks <laughs> i'm so uncomfortable inflicted the rot grants power before it grants release muscle replaced with darkness, organs pumping black bile through shattered veins. Infected enemy, <laughs> enemy, infected enemies are feeble, causing them to be knocked down when health is low. Use a finisher before they recover. That's good in there. Let's get. Oh, ah, he hit me. Yeah, I couldn't. So, a lot of animations you can't cancel. So once you're in that animation, that's it for you. Good job, good job. I missed this game. I'm sad there's no nobody in chat right now, but hopefully somebody on YouTube will watch. I just want you to leave comments. <laughs> Grateful for their lives, the peasants board the wagon. You've saved five citizens. I didn't know there were citizens there. I thought it was just the one guy that died, but okay. And there's more paths. I gained four fame. I don't like I don't like all this fame. Ooh, I should have I should have bought food before I did that. The Empire intends to staunch me, yeah. Yeah, I should go to the wagon. I didn't get anything from that either. I was hoping to get an event. I don't- oh fuck, I didn't mean to- We're not changing our appearance. But now it's loading in the, um, character. Thingy. I'm not going to change her today. We have a lion's crest and I, I'll show you the options. You can make her bald, give her some hairstyles. 
And of course change the color of the hair and all that, but I tend to like to have the hood on the character, you know. This is cool. Look at how long that braid is. Come on, girl. But yeah, this one's the prettiest to me. And then, of course, you can change your colors, which are nice. You know, it's a nice change, but we're rocking the golden white. We don't have a choice. So that means I'm gonna start losing max health instead. Map. Felted fence? I don't know if I know what that is. So we're gonna go in there and see what that is. Many never recover fully from the sickness that fills the fens. Okay, so as you can see, I already have four pieces. That glowing piece at the top is the one piece I don't have. So these are fragments. I didn't know that. Okay. Well, not that I didn't know that. It's just I didn't realize that this was the last piece. I'm happy that I am over here. On the downside, I only have 64 health. So I'm worried about what this is going to ask me to do. The miasma hangs in the air. Thick and roid- roidland? Redulant? I'm going to say redulant. <laughs> Haven't seen that word before. Of the- Dead things trapped in the dark waters. Just walking this path has been known to leave travelers with a lifelong cough. You spy an old carriage through the fog. Its wheels locked in the mire. The occupants either fled or were eaten by the inhabitants of the swamp long ago. Since the fog is thickest around its rotting timbers, there may be valuables within. I'm gonna grab my water real quick. <laughs> an itch in my throat. That was good. That's a reminder. Go drink some water, guys. Ooh! Ooh! I just got negative 10 maximum health. That is so bad. enveloped in the thick cloud of marsh grass. You carefully make your way across stones and fallen logs towards your target. Let me look at- oh, it's so much smaller on my computer screen. Ooh. No. An unfortunate time for your skills to leave you. Why are you always laughing at me like that, dealer? We we're friends. You fucking know that, right? <sighs> yeah, I'm so mad. I don't even want to read this. I got fucked up. Okay, got fucked up. Do, ooh, ooh, do I get an item? What do you do? You're also heavy. But. Um, as you can see, at the very bottom, right above damage and token, it says, Defeat 50 corrupted enemies with this weapon to unlock the token. I haven't unlocked the token. I only have 10 out of 50. This would be good. This would be good. But I think this is also good. Oh, this is for skeletons and undead, so no. Ooh. I'm not playing endless mode, but as you can see, food, it says gain two food. Oh, okay, so this is for, yeah, gain two food after every encounter in which you receive a gain card. I kind of want that. It has 10 defense. I'm pretty sure my armor right now only has five, I think. And it, it, reduces my movement speed by 10%, but I think it's better than what I have. Fuck. 
Yeah, no, it's not better than what I have because I get a corrupted 25% less damage and 5 defense. And also, instead of taking starvation damage, I only lose 1 max health. Did I accidentally take it? Or did I not take anything at all? I am besides myself right now. What? I didn't know I had other weapons. When did I get those? I am shook right now. I did pick up the gluttony armor. Damn. We're gonna keep the resist corrupted right now, though. Dead bodies litter the streets while white rats scurry in search of a feast. Burning rubble. Damn it. So, I... Honestly, it's just a waste because you don't get an encounter. What happens? Ooh, I have to fight. Oh my god. We're gonna ambush. And we... Ooh. Okay, I need to realize that there is no delay like there is for the card game. Yeah, this is probably the end of the run, guys. <laughs> We're going for the silver right now. Okay. So right now, there is no delay. Like, it, it clicked when I clicked it. So I have to fight the rest. We will be taking assistance, but I do think this is the end for us. This game is hard. I love it though. This is what these are one of the games that I sit and I play for hours. I play for like four hours, five hours at a time. I'm sorry you guys have to hear me burp. <laughs> the little ones are dangerous, but so are... Like, the big one to me is always more important than... Oh god, I stopped talking because I need to focus. His armor is gone, but he almost fucking killed me just now. Okay, so she is doing her auto finishers. I'm just now realizing it. Fuck. I was doing good. Thank you. I was trying to finish the other one off, but okay. Okay, she finished him. There we go, finisher. Sorry, you guys believe me, snap. I get excited. I'm excited. <laughs> I'm also sorry if this audio is actually trash. <sighs> All that for four fame and no food. <laughs> That appears to be the last of them, Kulpjorn remarks. You continue your journey through the winding streets. Winding streets. Is it winding? They spell winding. <laughs> I think it is winding. That's weird to me. Okay. For faith. All of that for for faith. Smoke fills the city and stings your eyes. The Empire intends to- yeah, yeah, I know. Do you wonder what lies beyond the gates of death? This corruption is but a small part of it. 
I was gonna say it's probably more death. Not not even gonna lie. In a game like this, what lies beyond death? More death. Also, um, if you've never seen this game before and you see that window and you're like, is that stuff moving in the background? We're in a carriage, I believe. The dealer is training me to take his place. I think that's the lore of the game. In the first game, um, he was challenging you, and I think he was trying to kill you at some point. I'm not sure, I can't remember. It's been several years. But now, he's training you, and as you can see, he doesn't look too good. He's still cool, though. At this point, I don't even care. Following it with my eyes. The thing about this is every time you do this, the wheel gets faster. Every time. The funny part about that is I wasn't following that one with my eyes, so that was just fucking luck. So, you know, the title. Is it luck or is it skill? So far, it's luck and a bit of skill. I'm not even gonna lie. <laughs> We do not need help, Australia. Even though it's looking bad for me, I am still not gonna like waste my resources as you can see, because I already did that. I was eating food when I shouldn't have. I should have just let my health drop. I just have to learn to be more careful. They're stunned. They're not stunned anymore. Oh my god. Okay, she was frozen into her, um... What the heck? She got frozen into her, um, final. And it, it really freaked me out just now. I don't want her to take damage. If you can tell, I don't want her to take damage. We do not have the resources to heal you. Thirty-one citizens. Okay. Four more fame. We're about to have more fame than we do money. But since we save citizens, there's a chance. I didn't read it like I was supposed to. There they didn't restore the store yet, so But as you can see, um if this is like you're like, what the fuck's happening? Um This is like showing that, you know, I need to adjust my deck. As you can see, the items that I'm gaining in this deck isn't really beneficial to me. I need to do more for food and less for fame. Because we're getting a lot of fame, but I don't need a lot of fame. So if I have cards in my deck that I'm playing with right now, which is the events and the items and uh, I believe food cards and all that and life cards and all that and healing and all of the blessings and curses as well all of those are in my deck to adjust my odds you put different cards in your deck and those tokens that i'm trying to get are like basically card packs there is no um gotcha in this game you can't just buy new cards and stuff so oh <sighs> The spread of plague has rendered the district a blackened maze. The crust of contagion warps cobblestones and weakens foundations, making progress perilous. More fights. And it's bad. Retreat. I'm not doing it. Ooh. Ooh, that's painful. <laughs> I actually cannot step on that card. But I already lost the health for it. This is probably going to have the same thing, to be honest. Oh my god. It blocked my way. You have no choice but to take another route. I am angry. We're going to try this way. No. <laughs> Come on. Even in the midst of terrors, 
there will always be traders who stayed too long hoping to profit. I'm angry that I didn't jump on this spot sooner. You have saved the merchant and his family, basically. Thank you, the merchant says, boarding the wagon. Should you find yourself short of gold? No, no, short of food. I'm short of food. I'd be happy to give you a good price for any equipment you might want to trade. You can sell equipment. We're going to the camp. <clears throat> oh my god. Uh, that is painful. I don't need money. If you're trying to figure out why it's painful, I don't need money. Just my luck. Oh my god. retreat I guess we're gonna go fight these guys because honestly the odds are not in my favor let's just go get murdered we're, let's just go get murdered and we're going to do this one because maybe maybe I'll be lucky and if I'm lucky <sighs> you see that you see how small these are oh it follows the silver for a good bit it doesn't anymore. It desynced. I should have taken that when I could have. Ooh! Aiming for the silver, but I got the gold. You've done well. <clears throat> Two monster cards. <laughs> and we. Ooh, ooh, I have a chance to do another. Okay. Patience. Do not move too quickly, for haste breeds only failure. I'm sweating. <laughs> so that means that might have been a chance to remove all of these corrupted, and that would have been fantastic. Estrella, we have two remaining, and I believe I'm gonna use one for the boss fight. But yeah, I'll just throw you in there, and the last one will be the boss fight, and hopefully we win that, because if we do, then um, it'll be enough to get a bronze, which I think is what all my other ones are. I think I just got bronze, not gonna lie. <laughs> is the game audio too loud? Probably. We'll figure it out in post. See how easy that was? We got rid of the big guys who had armor, so we just have regular infected. Kind of like a base level zombie, if you want to think of it like that. Zero corrupted remaining, but there's still a ton of fucking villagers. <laughs> that appears to be the last of them, Culptrum remarks. You continue your journey through the winding streets. You gain for fame, no new paths. We bring word from Captain Estrella. The soldier explains with a salute. The infected horde at the gatehouse has subsided. Okay, so the corruption counter is gone. I think you have to kill a certain number of them and then they just go away. It does before the gate is blocked by more layers of corruption. The wagons cannot get through. It must be destroyed. I think there's a third floor. Endless dark deeds have been done in the name of the Empire. May you set that ledger right, at least in part. Well, I'm just going to say I'm sorry, because I can't save these fucking people. Yeah. Yeah. Ow. I can't get gold. A 
Some are lost, but still there is hope for the city yet. Halt, a voice shouts from beyond the gate. You turn to see a troop of Empire soldiers marching through the gatehouse. Why do I have to fight them? By decree of the Emperor, none of you are permitted to leave the old city. Captain Fiar, you are to return to the Imperial City at once to report the captain commands. Captain Fiar scoffs, calling the young captain, calling to the young captain, blocking the gate. These people bear no mark of the corruption. All they want is safe passage. Emperor, decree or no, it is our duty to protect them. What good is a soldier who cannot follow commands? What is an empire without order? The young captain retorts proudly. By decree of the emperor, none of thee, none, are permitted to leave the old city. Captain Fear draws her pistol. Oh shit. Standing between the cowering old city refugees and the emperor de emperor's decree. I will not stand down. Get on in there, Australia. <laughs> Get on in there. We are fighting people with muskets. I think it said musketeers, so... I believe they have muskets, so I'm gonna be getting shot at, which means the B button is real important right now. <sighs> Please, give me the copper. Give me the copper, because I can't get the gold, and the silver is probably impossible to get right now, too. Me too. Captain Sterling. He hears the pleas from the old city, but does not weep. Orders are orders. Captains wear armor that dull standard attacks use bash to break their armor. Can't remember what bash is. Ooh, he was aiming at me. See, I wasn't aiming at him though. That's the part that pisses me off. Real mad he was aiming at me, help me. Ooh, he almost fucking got me. Don't know who you aiming at. Okay, his armor is busted and I just have to commit murder. Are you just a regular soldier? I just love it the way they just clip right through things. <laughs> I'm so happy. I can't believe I did that. I mean, I am a gamer, you know, like I am good at games, you know, I'm like. <laughs> you have befriended Estrella the soldier, which means she is a new companion. These emperor decreed injustices. Wow mouthful right there have been on the increase lately captain Vera says something ill is growing from within she pauses her ruminations she pauses her ruminations and gives you a stern look the emperor the empire would do well to have somebody like you serving it we'll see about that Estrella. so that means Estrella has her own cards now her own um her own missions so let's see what we unlocked since we got silver you differ there is no problem callous will not have solved through death yet you show mercy so these are just in my deck now right these are new cards that I've unlocked that are now in my deck. And and also, it might also be impossible to get gold a lot of these times when you do the quest the first time. Because the cards that make it easier for you to do better are unlocked from the bronze. So we got some new weapons, so I'm excited. And I think one of those was a curse. Some new armor. For befriending Estrella, we got her and her first quest. This is from that other card for surviving horse a suggestion to enter the trap dungeon i failed that one multiple times because i couldn't find the exit 
I didn't. I thought I was looking for a goblin and I just needed to find the exit. So now we have follow the goblin and a drunken knight does not look good. <laughs> So, this was a success. Look at that. I can Silver. no longer go easy on you. The usurper will not do so, and I must test you sorely before you arrive at his gates. I'm sorry. Ooh, that one's called death. Can you imagine? I think we did good. As you can see, I believe these are all bronze, because some of these are really hard, which means at some point I'm going to go back and do them. I mean, they, I can't tell if it would be gold or not. I'd have to go online. But I'm pretty sure they're bronze. I think I'm actually going to end the stream here. It's been roughly an hour and 30 minutes. So, I think that's good because it's going to take a while for this to render to get onto YouTube anyways, so. I'm probably going to play more of this next stream because I just, I had a good time. So yeah, 